Hey guys! back to AJ for fun. Today I am filming a doll video on how to make DIY doll shoes. So I have two disclaimers. Three. If you hear any noise in the background, it's my dogs. I'm really sorry. Well, it's G's dogs. I'm really sorry. Two. Um, make sure you have parents' permission because this may damage your doll. And three. If you're wondering why I have the same like stuff and furniture as G, it's because I have a key to her house and we normally film here because I don't have any doll stuff at my house. So, yeah. All the social medias are in the link in the description. If you're not already subscribed, you should do that right now. Also, hit the bell for notifications to become part of the hashtag AJ Squad. Let's get started. And if you're wondering why it's so steady, it's because we have a tripod. My mom's behind the camera. She's not going to say hi because she's my mom. Um, but yeah so the ingredients you will need are some oil you can use non-stick spray or oil i'm using vegetable oil because i don't know but you can use olive oil or canola oil or any oil it doesn't really matter you're also going to need some paper towel i have more over there i just ripped a little bit so it wouldn't take up the whole place also some hot glue sticks and a glue gun so Oh, and your doll. I'm using this doll because I don't have a lot of shoes for You're her. You're going to take some of your paper towel, rip it in half or rip it a little bit. Then take your oil, a cap full about. So I'm just going to take a little cap full and then put it over here. I don't want it to spill. Then dip some of your paper towel until it's all oily. Then take one of your doll's feet and make sure you put it down completely and wipe it. Don't wipe it off though, the oil. So now take your hot glue gun, which should be heated up by now. It is. I need to wipe this. Be super careful because it's hot. Also, make sure you're careful because you don't want to melt your doll. I mean, I don't know who would. Also, get a glass of really freezing cold water. Perfect. So, if I'm just going to put this out of the way over here. So, that's um, some cold water. So, start by putting a little bit over the toes. And we're going to speed up the process a little bit. So make sure all the any holes that you have left are full and finished. So I'm just going to quickly go through looking for any little holes. And filling them. And it's okay if it's super bumpy because we'll be fixing that in a minute. So I'll see you when all the holes are full. Alright, now we are going to, since everything is nice and... Ouch! Cut that out. Ouch. Since everything is nice and dry. See? Nice and dry. Since everything is nice and dry, we're just going to cut a little slit in the back, which I'm going to try and show you, like the American Girl shoes. So be so careful with this one. I do recommend having an adult do this part, but my mom is confident that I can do it myself. You're just going Since G's to parents these. are very, very strict, she's not normally allowed to do this. She was only allowed to do it in the one video because she was only cutting a line, and that's more safe than cutting on her doll. So I'm heating up this exacto knife a little bit on the hot glue gun just so it cuts just a tiny bit easier. And be so careful and do a little triangle as the little slit. 
And if you need your parents' help, don't worry, ask for help, trust me. I'm sure you'd rather not bring your American Girl. Especially your if they're expensive. So if you want to make an American Girl one or any other doll one, even your Welly Wisher if you have one, do the same exact thing but smaller or bigger. So, it is almost out and I'll get back to you when it's Now out. I'm just going to pop it off. Be very gentle. If you hear noises in the background, it's just my dogs playing. But, um, so I'm going to put the cap on this so I don't get hurt and put it to the side. And now pop it off. You might need a little bit of help from your X-Acto knife, but I don't think you will. Oh my gosh, it's so cool. It's coming off. Yes, yes, yes. Be gentle not to rip the shoe. But if you rip it a little bit, that's okay. Because the holes will be easily filled in with some extra hot glue. By the way, it won't be this hard every single time. Just the first time. Sorry, my mom just realized the camera was tilted for a little bit of the video. So, we're sorry about that. Because we, got, we know when you guys like good quality. This is the shoe when... So this is the shoe when it's off. It got ripped a little bit, but now we're gonna fill it in and I'm gonna show you how. So I finished filling in all of the holes and now I'm gonna show you how to smooth it. By the way, to make the other side, just double what you did here. But I'm gonna show you me doing the other side too, but all in fast motion. So to smooth it, you're gonna take, make sure it's completely dry too. You're going to take your paper towel, first dabbing it, because you're gonna to wanna to put it in some cold water because it hurts. <laughs> and um, use the tip of your hot glue gun to smooth down big air bubbles or big hot glue, glue bubbles. So I'm gonna do this in fast motion because it might take quite a while. See you in a minute. So I put a lot of nonstick spray in the middle of this pan and I put it on only two and this is how to get bumps out of the bottom fast. Only do this with parent supervision. So my mom's not doing it but she's right here to help me do it. So put it on, put it around, take it off, it's not good yet. Put it down for like 10 seconds or so, take it up. I'm going to put it on six. My mom's putting it on six. High on high. Never mind. My mom told me to put it on high. It's already right. steamy, and so I'm going to quickly put this down. My mom's right here guiding me, and I already see steam, and I'm so scared. I f see it going down. I see it going down, and I'm so scared. It's almost finished, so I'm gonna just do it a little bit more. And then be back to you guys. Smooth the rest with your hot glue gun, and then I'll be back. I'm gonna smooth the rest with it on my doll's foot, and so I'll be back. So you can leave it clear, or you can paint it. I'm going to paint it, and then let it dry, and see you tomorrow. Hi, guys. It's A, and I didn't get a chance to see you tomorrow. I just want to tell you this quick little outro. I just wanted to say thank you for watching this video, and subscribe also all our social medias are in the description i'll see you next saturday we'll see you next wednesday and we'll see you next monday bye